season, let us all pray the Stations of the Cross to commemorate Christ's crucifixion. Our prayer leaders for today are the following. First Station, Pagador. Second Station, Caballero. Third Station, Quirante. Fourth Station, Samson. Fifth Station, Ilagan. Sixth Station, Coro. Seventh Station, Alde. Eighth Station, Machitar. Ninth Station, Auditor. Tenth Station, Caballero. Eleventh Station, Diaz. Twelfth Station, Aripal. Thirteenth Station, Gumalo. Fourteenth Station, Manabat. Fifteenth Station, Melihor. Open your prayer guide to page 90. Mary's Way of the Cross. Prayer readers, please prepare. Now let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord Jesus, help me to be open to your closeness and presence as I begin my journey to Calvary with you. Help me to find in your passion and death the strength to take up my cross and follow you. Mary help the Christians pray for us. St. John Bosco pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now let us sing our Philippine National Anthem. Let us recite the Panatang Makabayan. Panatang Makabayan. DBTC Vision. Regime of Bosconians. Generously contributing to our nation's progress. Making their mark as workers, professionals, and entrepreneurs and leaders of society. Accepting the challenge of holiness and heroism in their respective spheres of influence and workplaces, we dream of our institution steady growth with a zealous edu educative pastoral community, joyfully journeying with the young in the spirit of St. John Bosco. DBTC Mission we are a Catholic Filipino solution educational institution characterized by a dynamic educative pastoral committee, competent and committed in sharing the mission of St. John Bosco. Deeply dedicated to integral development of the young, Delivering quality programs in the basic, tertiary, and vocational education, and in the youth center, undertaking relevant community services, responsive to the show political realities of the country. We are intensely devoted to form ourselves to the young as committed Christians and honest citizens with the heart for the poor. Good morning once again, my dear students. Today, we will learn about division with remainder. Please go to your Moodle Map course and click on Task in Math 3. Please watch the video. Making math as easy as 
one, two, three. Today we will learn about division with remainder. Just a quick recap from the previous vlog. Don't worry, I will put the link down below. Division is a method of distributing a group of things into equal parts. The main goal of division is to see how many equal groups or how many in each group when sharing fairly. Parts of a division equation. Let us all remember that the division has four parts divisor, dividend, quotient, and remainder. Divisor is a number that divides another number either completely or with a remainder. Dividend is the whole that is to be divided into parts. Quotient A result obtained by dividing one quantity by another. Now let's discuss about division with remainder. Is the amount left over after performing computation? Here's an example equation. Thanks for watching, hope you learned something new and don't forget to like, share and subscribe and ring the notification bell. Again this is Enzo and see you on the next one. Now let's check your understanding. Please get your pencil and math notebook. Go to your Moodle map course tree and answer the activity.
timer starts now. Time is up. The answer is 35 remainder 5. If you got it right, you understood the lesson well. If not, please watch the video again and study. Please study. We will have a formative test next meeting. Bye class. slave.